Welcome back to Settler Motor TV. Today we're going to be taking a ride on a 2023 Lowrider S. It'll be my first time riding a Lowrider S. This right here is Achilles, our 2019 Harley Davidson Street Bob. And this right here is my homie's bike. He just got it not too long ago. So I will show you real quick just a couple of things that he's done to it so far. He does have big plans for it. And then we're gonna take it out on the road and I'm gonna experience the Lowrider S for the first time. As my opinion from a street bob owner, he's also gonna try my bike and my bar setup right now because I know he does have plans with his bars himself. So here's Achilles, our 2019 street bob. And here is Leonidas, this 2023 Lowrider S. So, so far to this 2023 Lowrider S, he has done uh, license plate uh, different bracket here he has this super sick CC bar from biking as you guys can see he has a saddleman touring seat on it he has some dual Benson Hines long shots on the bike for now but I know he has plans for different pipes he has the moons MC rider pegs the floorboards and I know he has the ones in the rear coming but they're waiting on a part of their back order so he has his own for now he has a hot works engine guard in the front he has the brake link from trashing supply as well as the shift link from trashing he has the Avon grips and Arlen Ness levers he has the traction supply bar back plus and the bar purse clamps as well as the Memphis Shades Roll Warrior front fairing here just like Achilles. It's time to get Lonitas on the road. Let's get her started. Now, as soon as I throw my leg over it, I notice right away the stock height of the bike. Obviously, as you guys know, on Achilles, my 2019 Street Bob here, I do have the Ross Wernamon uh, 13 and a half inch rear shock. So I'm now used to a taller rear suspension on this 2023 Lowrider S. Obviously, we still have the stock suspension front and back but I'm glad that he hasn't changed them yet because I got a chance to experience the factory suspension on this bike. Uh, it feels uh, not bad at all, it feels nice. And one thing that I noticed uh, right away on taking turns on this bike is that the front does seem uh, a little lighter to me. Uh, I'm not sure if the weight of the wheels uh, are different from mine but I know the inverted forks give you a different feel on the turns for sure. When you get on this bike, as soon as you uh, try to merge into traffic, it definitely uh, takes off. And I'm definitely looking forward to seeing this bike with a stage two at least. Uh, it's definitely going to make a huge difference, but no complaints for sure, uh, completely stock either. Another huge difference that I noticed on the Lowrider S is the gas tank. Obviously the gas tank seems a lot bigger when you sit on the bike coming from a street bob. If I remember correctly, I think the street bob has like a 3.1 or something like that gallon tank. And the Lowrider S is about a five gallon. Correct me if I'm wrong on that, but the size is definitely uh, noticeable. Jose, I enjoy taking your bike for a rip out today, man. Uh, thank you for coming up here and taking a quick ride with me. My homie came up here on a three and a half hour ride just to go on a short ride with me. And he had to ride three and a half hours back because I am leaving Texas. This is probably my last 
right here in Texas. I will be going back to Florida as we are still a military family. So stay tuned. The next videos coming on this channel are going to be already in Florida more than likely. I am grateful to have been able to ride in some of the areas that I've been able to ride in Texas since I've been living in Texas for the last uh, two and a half years or so. And I will miss some of these roads from the Dallas tunnels all the way to the hill country roads. But in a way, I am glad and looking forward to seeing the ocean again and being able to take the Harley Achilles here on rides along the ocean and bringing you guys with. We will continue the build on Achilles here, our 19th Street Bob, and we will take you guys on many more rides once we're in Florida. If you guys are new to the channel, thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. If you guys are not new to the channel, thank you for watching again. Stay safe. I'll see you guys on the next video.